WFNN. Headline News Update. Oh, baby, watch out. The Fed came out with numbers, but guess what? One of the Tigers told me something that's much more important. February 1st, 2022, year of the Tiger. Gotta love it. Thanks, Dan, man. That's, that is awesome. And my grandson, Tommy's birthday is February 2nd. That is a beautiful thing. Market-wise, Dow up 84, NASDAQ up 59, S&P's up 16, gold. Gold contract down $3.30, trading at 1768 an ounce. We have silver down 24 cents, $21.64 an ounce. Light sweet crude up 24 cents, $70.96 a barrel, notes and bonds. The 10-year down six ticks, trading 134.14. The 30-year off seven, 16 ticks at 161.23 and king dollar. King dollar down 38 ticks, trading 96.533. That's a big deal, folks, okay, because the bottom line is we'll go through it. But numbers came out that tested its high, couldn't handle it. It's backing off again. Gold was down. Didn't want to stay lower. In fact, in Gold's place, you're going to see three separate hammers um, in the last uh, three months. So we have three lower, three higher lows and two higher highs. We're going topside, man. Euro's at 112, yen's at 114, the British pound's at 132 to one U.S. dollar. We get over and take a look at the spy market. Basically, took, you know, it's pretty amazing how and. We've talked about this before. Tommy and I have talked about it when we were doing the show together, when I've called in to his show, that every single time we think these Fed days are going to be so huge. But this one really seemed like it was going to be bigger. Uh, bottom line, somehow that market already really basically knew whether the, the Fed comes out and starts filtering into the marketplace and say, OK, we're going to uh, you get rid of the uh, quantitative easing quicker. We're gonna, then we're going to look at the rates. The bottom line, the market's just shaking us off, man. Uh, that being said, spy, spy's going to its highs, man. You know, you came down yesterday. See, this is a, this is a classic. You came down yesterday, you had a volume expansion as you come down. You come down, you almost tested it today. You have lighter, you're going to have lighter volume. And the bottom line that's saying that now the highs game again, particularly uh, because of the season that we're in also. And what you're going to have here, folks, okay, there's no more um, big announcements here before uh, Christmas holiday and the New Year's. This market will... I suspect is going to run to higher price. Um, Q's, Q's rejected 383, and they're up $7 since then, man. The highs, the highs games right now. Stay right there, folks. Come right back.